Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, uh, because I think, what is it? It is easier, let's say, to, if, if you have, for example, now, if you have an Islamic banking, then you have a group of people with share and background, and then with accountant coming in, mm -hmm. which is quite difficult to, to make, no, okay, no offense to the Sharon people, to make them understand, right, mm -hmm. the accounting issues. Mm -hmm. So, but if you have the accounting student, you don't need to be a Sharon expert. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. But then you understand the issues, the Islamic issues, and then, but then you have a, a good accounting background, then you can appreciate it is better. So, we are trying to find a student, to so a student, you have accounting, but then you have at the back of your mind then this is how Islam works. The world views of Islam is how is it. You don't need to know the nitty gritty of the thick issues, the Shana issues, but then it is presented to you by then how do we treat these issues then in accounting. Okay, so that is a, ch a very challenging part. The university has tried to do that. Perhaps we may need in some student, not in the other student, that sort of thing. Right? But you can see the fruits a bit now. But the idea is human then. Uh, right. Terus teringat pasal apa? The audit punya equation tu kan? On, on the risk. <laughs> Alright. Okay, right. Um, but of course, I, I cannot find a pinpoint, a pinpoint the exact time. But at, um, if you look into the Islamic history regarding the the kejatuhan, the fall of the, a lot of the uh, the dynasties, of course, there's a uh, Abbasiyah, Umayyah. I think when it start, uh, if you look into Ibn Khaldun, Muqaddimah, I think they talk about that. Uh, very interesting. Okay, uh, a lot of other scholars, even the Western scholars. The ideas, Bosworth, for example, okay, talk about that. Uh, <laughs> mudah sangat ya, nak hubud dunia, cinta dunia. I think it is start from there. Okay, so uh, if you look um, in, in relation to that, uh, bila we talk about the state accounting, bila kantong kerajaan semakin kurang sebab dia hidup semakin mewah, yeah? so dia akan minta lagi. So therefore, you try to find ways and means untuk 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 isi kantong tu, eh, the funds of the the treasuries of the state. Therefore, at that point of time, when you try to, okay, eh, you have the auditor, but then the auditor is trying to do that's finding fault at that point of time, rather than uh, uh, the the case in the state, for example, it is Earl that is doing the Khalifa Umar, one of the Sahaba. Uh, uh, what is it? Try uh, not try, found something. Uh, I do not know. How much is it? But then, there is a discrepancies. Okay, uh, Sahabah Amir Jarrah. Okay, define. Oh, ada, was it? I, I do not remember whether it is mentioned one dirham or two dirham. Reported to the uh, Sayyidina Umar. Alright? And then some scholars say, how do you find, how how does this uh, uh, happen? How does this thing happen? Therefore, then the scholars say that it is probably because of the audit at that point of time. Okay. You come because at that point of time the the accounting of, we talk about kalau pernah perkataan D1 the term that is used D1 D1 basically you have a D1 D1 al insha D1 al jaish askar D1 askar di macam department lah okay. macam department di panggil D1 okay but then uh, at that point of, and then they also by tulmal uh, the the head accountant is monitoring all this so basically you have Ledger for this, ledger for this. Our term is ledger for this. Okay, the one for this. But then, bila sampai ke atas tu, dia tak tak cross check accounting. Okay, tak sama. Dia tak uh, among the different. That's where people know. That's where the uh, the sahabah just now, Amar Jarrah, they know. Eh, ada discrepancies between the sub ledgers and then the main ledger. Okay, uh, that's where it comes. Uh, although dia tak panggil audit masa tu, tapi that's how it is found. Because you are checking this, yeah. I mean that's interesting. Right? Ah, exactly. At the point of time, so 
you, you have two cases during those time but then one of the case is accountant kena bayar <laughs> or the discrepancies too accountant kena bayar what oh, that is interesting what is the role of accountant kat situ dia yang kena accountant lah bukan audit ya ha, accountant yang kena bayar Oh, that interesting. It was found by the auditors, kan? Quote unquote auditors lah. At that point of time. Tapi masa tu, as you said, it is because of prone to make error, to make mistake. Therefore, even that, it just, well, this is a mistake because of non-recording ke macam mana. But still, okay, in terms of responsibility of the accountant is still great. You cannot just say, ah, okay, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Uh, I, that, uh, yeah, being, being, being accountant is, I think, uh, if you look into the history, the accountant is a, it is a precious uh, occupation. Dia tidak dia ajar mass lecture macam ni. Accountant is taught, accounting is taught rather in a in an apprentice kind of way. So only if you are attached to the accountant, your account clerk attached to the accountant, you are the one that is going to know. It is not taught that. That's why the, the term, uh, if you look, uh, what I uh, mentioned, Risala uh, Falakiyah, the Al-Mazandrani, the books there. It is, it is written, the book itself, uh, no, they show the books, and then the example of account, it is written in a, what is it, the term that is used is siyakat. Siakat writing. Siakat basically is... Orang tak tahu. Kita bahasa apa? Kalau dulu, terengkas. Ya? Oh. Orang biasa takkan faham. Only so, to show the the secrecy and the, to show that this is a very important thing. Tak boleh ajar. So, uh, that's the account. They are preparing their account using the siakat word. It is Persian plus plus Arabic. But then, tak ada titik lah. Memang kita tak boleh nak baca lah langsung. Dia tunjuk, tengok manuskrip tu memang kita tak boleh baca. So, kalau dah Arab tak baca, ini lagi lah kita tak boleh nak baca kan. Uh, 